Hello best friend and welcome welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fabulous day. This is the first time you're watching my channel. My name is Sebastian and I welcome you guys with open arms. I do pop culture videos every single day. So if you're looking for a new messy best friend you have found me, grab a snack, grab a drink, hit that subscribe button girl. I would be very grateful. You guys, before we get into this Justin Bieber and Hailey Bieber messy tea, I wanted just to say a very, very quick little thing to you. Today's Monday, so I always try and do a little bit of Monday motivation. Um, Today, I did something that I haven't done in a while by myself. I went hiking and I took like the hard route and I filmed it. If you guys want to watch it, I, I posted it on TikTok. But um, I, I just had like this little message that I wanted to tell you guys that, you know, I feel like we all have our goals. We all have like our things we want to accomplish, whether it's gaining weight, losing weight, getting that job, you know, whatever personal goals we have. And I think that the most like easiest thing we can do is like in our minds, I don't know about you, but I'm always thinking, okay, Monday, I'm going to start, I'm going to go, I'm going to do. And while I'm like preparing myself mentally to like start Monday, I'm feeling on top of the world. It's already like I've accomplished it. You know, I'm going to go to the grocery store. I'm going to buy all keto things. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do this. And when Monday morning comes, you're like, girl, I never said that shit. And then starting is the hardest. So this morning, damn it, it was hard. My stomach was hurting. I was bloated. I had a headache. My mom called me. She she had a little uh, thing to tell me that really, you know, turned me off. Um, like, you know, just so many like things that I could have definitely said, I'm not going. I don't care. Blah, blah, blah. But then I thought to myself and I said, you know what? Like the hardest thing is just to start. So I don't know. My, my husband was such an amazing support. But I, I just got up and I said, you know what, Sebastian, just fucking go. So, and I did it, you guys. And it was hard. It was definitely hard. But I did want to tell you that anything is possible. So if you're looking for a sign to freaking tell you that you got this and that you will do it and that you deserve to have your goals accomplished and you deserve to, to, to really reach your goals and to be happy, this is your sign. And of course, I already did it. So I'm annoyingly motivational and, and like upbeat. And of course, tomorrow when I have to do it again, I'm going to be like fucking Wednesday Adams. But, you know, you have to take your wins and you have it doesn't matter how little or big they are. Just take them and you deserve to be happy. OK, that's what I wanted to say, you guys. So. All right. Now to the tea. And of course, I know somebody's going to be like, the tea starts at 250. OK, no, bitch. The tea started at 0000. zero, zero, zero OK, bitch. So listen. Um, Justin Bieber and Hailey Bieber are going viral because of their very different um, uh, fashion uh, choices, okay? So they have, every time that they go out, they literally look like they're going to two separate events. Like they look like they're two separate, they're going to two separate places, okay? And Justin is getting called out. Like I already made that video about his recent uh, outing with um, uh, with Hailey uh, and not looking you know, or looking a little bit more low key than you would to your wife's event. And that caused a lot of conversation and a lot of people had a lot to say. So let's talk about should couples always fucking match and should couples dress up for each other? So I already told you guys about this the other day. I said, you know what? If my husband was having a, a, an event that it was going to be photographed and, you know, I, and it was like an, a, a dressy event, I would dress up, you know, I would put, because that shows to him that I care for his things, that I want to be, you know, there for him, right? But here's the thing, you know, that you have to really take into consideration is we don't know about Justin's mental health. And that is where a lot of people, you know, kind of miss the mark on it because they're like, okay, but like, can he just like wear a jeans and like a shirt, right? But th here's the thing, like you never know what somebody's going on with in their mental health, right? I fully think that, you know, if if he is going through something he shouldn't even go you know and that that's where sort of like my my distaste with Hailey Bieber also lies in is that there's a there's part of me that believes that like he feels somewhat pressured to go because he knows that if they go together they're going to get photo uh, photographed and it's going to you know make her her event bigger and bigger and bigger and it's going to be worldwide right but, uh, you know aside from if she goes by herself maybe it's not going to get that much traffic 
So I so that's the part that like I know really really annoys a lot of people because they're like he is literally dressing like if he's like boycotting your event, you know. But should couples dress the same? Should couples, you know, dress up for each other? I think so, you guys. And I'm sorry. I feel like look, there's been plenty of times that, you know, I've had something or my husband had something or we had plans and maybe one of us wakes up in the wrong side of the bed. Maybe I'm, you know, I'm the one who has anxiety and depression. Um, and there's been many times where, you know, I, I'll, I'll really want to go and support or I really want to go and, and be with him. But there's just my mental health just won't, you know, won't allow me. And, you know, something like getting dressed feels like Mount Everest when you are going through it mentally. So, you know, that that's the thing I, I wouldn't, you know, criticize. But then, you know, I feel like your partner, your husband, like my husband says to me, well, then, you know, don't go like, I'd rather you not go than, you know, be miserable, right? And I think that's like the thing that that they just like, don't, they just don't understand. They just don't do is, you know, he obvious looks, he obviously looks horribly miserable every time he goes out he but every time he goes out he just looks like you know he'd rather not be there and then his clothing shows that he's expressing how much how very little he wanted to to go there so they're being they're being they're literally going viral because everyone is like they're going to two different events and and i feel like the the majority of the people is criticizing not only Haley, but Justin and saying, Justin, you're a big boy. You you can make your own decisions. But then people are being like, but how can he make his own decision if he's not mentally okay? So obviously it's sort of like a merry-go-round that does not stop because we don't know what really is going on. We don't know really what is happening. We don't know really what is, you know, what is really, really, really like beneath, you know, and underneath everything. But I do have to say that Justin does definitely look like he didn't want to be there. Justin looks like he'd rather be at a fucking all-you-can-eat buffet in a shady-ass hotel in Las Vegas. You know what I mean? Like, I really feel like he just, you know, did not want to go there. And then inside, he'll smile. Inside, he looks like he's having fun. So that's like the part that, you know, that I just, you know, that's the part that I feel like nobody really talks about is his hatred for the paparazzi, his hatred for the whole commotion. And we've said this many times, take the back entrance, take the back entrance, or just don't go. But everybody's always like criticizing everything. And now they're going viral for, you know, having two separate, you know, like they're going to two separate events. But I feel like they are definitely in two separate places. Justin, I feel like does not want to be famous anymore. Justin, I feel like wants nothing to do with the limelight. And Haley wants to suck it all at one time. She wants to be famous. She wants the limelight. She wants to sell, 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 sell. And I think Justin is tired of it. So I don't know, you guys. It's just, you know, it's, it, it's one of those things where I feel like, you know, at some point, they're gonna have to have a conversation and really talk about it and say, okay, girl, listen. Um, you want this, I do not want this. What are we gonna do about it? You know, how are we gonna like how are we gonna meet halfway? Because girl, this is not working, honey, okay? Um, or maybe it is for them. Maybe Haley loves when he dresses like this. Maybe Haley loves to see him, you know, because here's the thing also, maybe that's just who he is. And I think that's something that's maybe like causing so much commotion within his fans because they're like, he never was like this before. You know, he started dressing down. He started seeming like he doesn't care when he got with Haley. So I don't know, you guys. I, it's just one of those things that I feel like we will never know until they one of them opens their mouth and does like a, an interview, you know, and lets people in. But my thing is, take the back entrance or don't go. Or... Just simply, or that's just how he likes to dress. You know what I mean? That's another thing that we all have to understand as well. I mean, maybe he feels like he's dressed up. Maybe he feels like that's being dressed up. Maybe he that's his new fashion. Maybe that's his new style. Who knows? You know what I mean? My husband and I dress very differently. I'm all about sparkle and he's more about low key. You know what I mean? So 
I feel like everyone is a little different, but I mean, like I said, we can sit here all day long coming up with different conclusions and theories, but until we hear from them, we will never know. But what do you guys think? Do you think that Justin should put a little bit more effort when he goes to these events with Haley, or do you think that he's just being himself and, you know, it doesn't matter? Let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear from you guys. And also remember, you got this, bitch. Whatever you want to accomplish, I know that you can, okay? I love you all so much, and I will see you guys in my next video. Mwah.